Nice to see you again in this extreme survival course. No panic. It's just a virtual reality simulation. Don't waste time trying to open the door. It simply won't budge because of the force of the water pressing on it from the outside. Remember, first of all, you have to unfasten your seat belt. Great. Now you gotta lower the window and try to get out of the car. According to statistics, electronic devices continue working inside a sinking car for about 10 minutes after driving. Okay, plan B. If the window refuses to open, don't waste your time and break the glass. Oh no no, don't even try to break the windshield. The most efficient option is to remove the headrests and break the glass with the metal prongs at the end of them. Unfortunately, you're not very forward-looking and you haven't put a special glass-breaking hammer. Wait until the car is completely filled with water. This will equalize the pressure inside and outside the car, and the door will open. Take one last deep breath and open the door. Remember that water around a sinking car gets murky and cloudy. So follow the air bubbles to get to the surface. Mission accomplished. Great job. <laughs>